So what is your, what is your guys' kind of secret sauce when it comes to actually finding and acquiring these brand exclusives and being the only seller of the products? Yeah, I think really the secret sauce is the, the confidence, right? The confidence. But here's the, the secret of the secret sauce is the confidence comes from experience, Right. So I think when you can go into a relationship or a potential relationship, super confident about your expertise in whatever niche, this one specifically Amazon and brand partnerships and managing brands on Amazon, when you can go into that with the confidence that you know what you're doing and you can basically guarantee that this brand will grow. I mean, that just takes the opportunity to a whole new level. Yeah, for sure. I mean, there there's so many products, especially doing wholesale that you come across that's like, man, if I could only optimize this list, yes. it would just be yeah. killing it. So yeah. is that how you found a lot of your brand partnerships? Like you were selling their products already and then you built that relationship over time or other ways than that? Yeah, hundred percent. I mean, a lot of them come from that products that we're selling, buying from distributors and wholesalers that we we're buying just general wholesale from, and then we're like, "Wow, we've been buying this product a lot. Like, maybe we can establish a connect, uh, direct relationship with this brand and really enhance their whole entire brand on Amazon to make them more money and make us more money and really optimize everybody's shopping experience mm -hmm. on Amazon. But another software that we use or another skill we use to acquire some of these brands is Smart Scout, okay, which is an amazing software. A good friend of mine, Scott Needham, created, who I'm sure you're familiar with, and uh, you know it really helps sort the data. You know, for and the recommended sort would be like twenty to one hundred thousand dollars in monthly sales revenue, right? So you're not you're not targeting like the Huggies, you know, these massive brands. You're looking for those small, medium sized brands to really take. 